Hello YouTubers! It's Magic the Gathering UK here again! And today, we're opening up another couple of Modern Masters 2015 edition booster packs! Yes we are, we've been pretty screwed so far. Um, I thought I got something pretty decent in the last one with the Wilt Leaf Liege Foil, but it's only worth about 7 bucks in the end, not 10 like I thought, so... Uh, we're not doing too well, we've got nothing but junk rares so far, but maybe these two will have something good. Maybe these will. Maybe a remand or something as well. That'd be nice. Anyway, let's get these land lady ant blah, 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 blah. <laughs> lady hands in here and let's do this. Boom shakalaka. Let's see what we get. These are always exciting to open though, these modern masters. <clears throat> so much money down the drain, but whatever. It's all about the thrill. Alright. Oh, it's upside down. How weird. Could it be that these have been tampered with? No, of course not. Mana leak. Nameless inversion. Um. um well, this is a screw up. <laughs> uh, this is a bit weird. <laughs> Repeal. Maybe they have been tampered with. Who knows? Apostle's blessing. These are quite easy to tamper with. These packs, but the guy seemed pretty legit. Waking nightmare. I can see any tampering on the package either, so... Vigian Graft Mage. Could just be a really weirdly packed pack. Inner Flame Igniter. Plummet. Alloy Mirror. Evolving Wilds. First uncommon is Vampire Outcasts. Hearth Fire Hobgoblin. Oh, the blue, I thought it was going to be a, a remand, but no, it's a mole drifter. It's a weird flying fish, and the rare. Oh, it's black. Is that black? It's... All is dust. That's not too bad. That's about a $10 card, I think. Mm, is it, though? I think it might actually be $12. It's somewhere around there, but that's a cool card. I like the art on that card a lot. And because it's like a, a weird Zendikar-ish one, I think, it's got like the... Oh, in the background of the border as well. So I kind of like that card. That's a really nice card. I'm glad I got that one. And a foil blue. Could it be remand? Probably not. What's it begin with? C. <gasps> what? Cryptic. Oh my god. That is. Is that good? That is worth a lot of money. Oh shit. That is worth a lot of money. The non foil is $50. <gasps> So I have no idea how much the foil was as well. Do you want to quickly look that up? Oh, it takes ages on this shit. Oh, did you close it all? Yeah, sorry. Look, it's not even loading my home page. Well, we'll have a look at that. We'll, we'll get Turn it going. Turn the next video. Yeah. Well, well, we'll find out by the end of the video. Oh. I'll have to, oh, I need to do the other pack. Wow. Wow, that's insane. <laughs> Bear me a second, guys. I'm just going to grab my phone so while we're opening this pack I can find out how much, how much that's worth. Kick the cat in the process. But wow, foil cryptic command, guys. That is insane. Wow, we hit something good. Very good. Finally. That is that is very good. That might have just paid for all the packs, so that's good. <laughs> There's a cat. Cat, please. Celebrating with us. Alright, so pack number two then. Sweet. I'm really chuffed about that. Whew. Relief. Let's get another one. Indeed. <laughs> all right. Oh. So, oh, they're upside down again. Maybe these are lucky packs because they're all uh, <laughs> messed up with the uh, packaging. All right. So we have a nest invader, gore horn minotaurs. Uh, yeah, that's weird. They're packed the same way, like. Two upside down and then back to normal again. Alright, so Crypto Command Foil is. Oh, Foil is $45. Okay, I got it wrong. I thought the non foil was for you, but still. Still, though. <laughs> $45 card there. Sweet. Fortify. Death Denied. Wings of Velis Vel. Court Homunculus. He's a weird looking chap, isn't he? <laughs> nice robe he's got on. 
Oosh. Vish new Slaughtermaster. Viashino. Vines of Vastwood. Fiery Fall. Ruined Servitor. And the uncommon then is a Stormblood Berserker. We still want a remand. Azorius Chancery is the second uncommon. And it was gold, it's not blue. Agony Warp is the final uncommon. It's a pretty weird looking card. And the rare, is it green? That'd be pretty sweet. If we could get a Tarmogoyf. <gasps> it's a Khan Liberated. No way! <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, that's worth like forty dollars as well. Wow. <laughs> yeah, okay. You can't complain. That's the fourth one I've opened now. I've opened three in my new Phyrexia box that I did a while back. <laughs> and we got another card liberated, wow. Yeah, I think that's about forty dollars ish. Damn son. That was a this was a good couple of packs. I picked some good ones. Yeah, what's this? Uh, what's the foil then? Can we get foil remand? No, it's white. That's terrible then. Cami of Ancient Lore. <laughs> and there's the foil. Oh my giggity googity garg. <laughs> well, that was uh, spectacular packs. So we got about eighty dollars worth of cards in those two packs. So that covers basically the entire lot of packs I bought. So. Very nice, and I actually have a place at Okan now, which is cool. Alright, so let's go through. Um, oh, yeah, anyway. Khan <laughs> Liberated, we got. I've put it in a sleeve, so you might not be able to see it very well, but. Khan Liberated. We got a Kami of Ancient Lore foil. We got a Cryptic Command foil, which is just insane. That's a really good card. And we also got an All Is Dust, which is also a pretty good card. It's about $12, I think. So overall, a very, very good couple of packs there. So there we are. A couple of amazing packs of Modern Masters 2015 edition. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. There's Khan, look, we got him. We got the bastard. Hope you enjoyed <laughs> the video. Please do hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed it. Subscribe, leave us a comment, let us know what, what you want to see on the channel. Uh, yeah, we'll see you again soon for more magic goodness. Bye-bye.